Yo. Hold on. I feel like I got on a fucking 2014 ass fit on. With this fucking... Let me take this bitch off. Hold on. Alright. That that fit was fucking atrocious. Felt like fucking... I was say, I look like Zendaya. When she was in her shake it up phase, you know? But anyways. It feels weird being on camera right now. Alone. Because usually, you know, I'm on the pod. Or I'm just recording my friends. Hold on. I'm finna turn on the air. It's kind of hot in here. Anyways, as I was saying been a minute since I feel or well, at least I feel like it's been a minute since I've been on um on my own channel alone reacting to shit you know but um that's besides the point as y'all seen from the title I'm reacting to the kingpin with the semifinals um I've I haven't seen much of it I know Gib and um What's his name? King Kenny one. I know I've seen reactions from it, and I've seen a I I've seen like the smallest clip from King Kenny's um. Oh shit! Why the fuck is that on? Hold on. I don't know how to respond to that. What's that show? Anyways, yeah, I've seen that. I've seen the like a small clip, and I'm not gonna lie, King Kenny was piecing the fuck out of um Winderson Nunez Nunez New. I don't even know what his last name was, but um he was piecing him up. I'm gonna show y'all. What I said last time about this, if I even said who was gonna win, I don't know. I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna keep it 110%, which I thought Gib was gonna come in and like walk through everybody, you know? Cause Tom that doesn't have a gas tank. I didn't know if if Jarvis had a chin. I didn't know if Kenny had a killer instinct, you know? I didn't know what my main Nate was all about. And the same with, um, what's his name? Winderson. I didn't really know much of him, and I don't know how good he, he how well he fought. But um, yeah, we're gonna react to Gibb versus Jarvis first, Jarvis, and then King Kenny versus Winderson. And I hope this shit is able to post, cause last time for King for Misfits, they don't let you react to it and post that for some reason the fights. You know it's kind of bullshit if you ask me, but um. We move regardless. And these are just the highlights for Gib and Jarvis because I'm, I'm glad I found these because I was not reacting to the whole... How long was it? 20 minutes? 30? I was not reacting to all that. No offense, boys, but not for me. All right. Let me see. All right. It's recording. And let's get right to it. I'm not going to lie. I think this might just be Gib highlights. I think it is give highlights, but Jarvis was not doing bad like the first few seconds of this. And right now he just threw a good, uh, I think it was a hook, he threw a good hook. Okay, okay, okay. Not a bad first round, not a bad first round at all. Damn. Yeah, Gibb definitely has more experience than you could tell. Not only that, Gib, Gibbs' um, gas tank is so much higher. I feel like at least more than anybody else in the influencer boxing scene. Okay, I don't think Jarvis is getting. Ta okay, he got hit with a hook. All right, hook. Oh shit! Yeah, Jarvis is getting tagged. Not not by a lot though. Oh, that was good overhand by Gib. Good body shot. Mm -mm. Damn. Gibbs, Gibbs are good punches, but Jarvis is walking down on some of them. It, it doesn't look like he, he's getting hurt much by these punches that get throwing. Yeah, it looks like Jarvis is tired, I'm not gonna lie. The thing is though, Gib is always active. Even when, when he's not throwing punches, he's still smothering Jarvis. But see, look, that, those are good punches from Jarvis, but he's not moving out of that, out, off the ropes, should I say. So Gib's just gonna do what he wants while Jarvis is in this corner. Oh. Damn. Gibbs actually doing throwing a lot of good body shots. I'm not gonna lie either. Oh, 
Oh my god. Okay, yeah, that was it. Hey, man. I'm not gonna lie to you. Give is good. I'm not down to give at all. But I don't think... Actually, I don't know. I was gonna say, I don't, he doesn't have knockout power. But he did knock out and knock down Austin about, like, what, 10 goddamn times? Old ass man. He did good. It was really... I think it's also a lot more experience that, um... Gib has, if I'm being completely truthful. Yeah, Jarvis is good. I'm not gonna lie. I always thought he was he was good for where he was at. I remember I read to a, a clip of him and Nick LMAO um, sparring, and he I don't remember what I said, so I'm not even gonna try to be like, oh yeah, he did good. But I know he had potential, and I'm pretty sure he still has potential. He shouldn't look at this shit and quit, you know. But um, unfortunately, there was no highlights for um King Kenny. And Wonders and Nunez. So I have to watch the whole thing. And then I'm gonna see about if I could cut it. If I could cut it up a little bit. But now the actually I'm gonna talk about the winners facing each other after this. But let's let's get straight into this. Alright, let's see. I did God damn! Right now, round one. Is she shaking? She's shaking! Oh I missed it. She's shaking it, she's shaking it. On or overcome. I will be in attendance next time. He oh. wants winners to come in over aggressive so we can counter him. We mentioned confidence. He's even. Damn, the crowd is insane. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. He's a fighter, man. And now he's taunting a little bit with his jab. Doubling it up as well. Oh. Great head movement from Kenny. Good head movement. We saw the transformation when the win was announced in the back, didn't we? We saw that. Nah, he, he he got a he talking his shit right now. Damn. Will Winderson into it, but here's the thing, Malcolm. I can't fight for him. And Kenny right now is putting on display with that lead hand. Lead he, oh my god, bro. No glaze, no glaze, but he kind of doing his thing in this bitch. I'm not gonna lie to you. To take the sting out of everything that's behind Nunes. Nice it's block. It's to get Nunes ooh. right here. It's to get him a little bit more inside, right? Yeah, come forward. Ooh, come forward like ooh. Continue Wonderson's getting cooked. Not by being right in the middle of the ring before Wonderson... 7.30, 7.30. I'm just saying it's time out for like editing. Ooh. Right here from oh, that hurt it. Ooh. That hurt Wonderson. Okay. Man, big shot. This is it. It's just a and the thing is, Kenny's being patient. He's not even not patient, but he's attentive. You cannot allow like he knows that hurt him, but he's not really going for it. Shit, it's kind of hard though. It's the variety of the work as well, though, Wes. Ooh, Angolado. When is it right here? Well, oh my god. Oh my goodness, they told me about this when I went and watched him spar and train. They said his left hook is deadly. No, nah, that's I didn't even see because I was, I was talking to y'all. But when Winderson was like this, oh, Bono, Kenny just break that. This is bad news Ooh. if you're a Winderson fan. Kenny but oh my god. Oh my god. Can he close the show? Oh my god, I think it's over. Nah, there's no way it's over right now. Yeah, there's no way it's over. I love this patience here from Kenny. He's not looking to rush anything. This fight Me and Wade, the entire time. like that. I said the same thing. You're having success fighting your fight. Just because you knock Winterson down doesn't mean you change the game plan. You do exactly what you're doing. Hairline crazy still though. My fault, Kenny. Come on now, throw some. Kenny, just patient here on the ropes. Great head. Damn. He can afford to be at this pace and at this work rate with the man he's landing. He's not even exerting himself. Yeah, I don't know if, if Winterson could have gone against KSI. I'm not going to lie. Winterson shakes that one off, but we've already seen what the damage Kenny can do. I don't even think he could have gone against Gibb. Gibb. And he's trying to, like you said, he's trying to get Maybe Jarvis. Like, come on, yeah, come forward. But if Jarvis got better head movement, he definitely could have. Not one against Jarvis. Jarvis against Tom Zanetti probably could have had a good fight with Winterson. Winterson probably could have won, but this. I don't know. Oh, damn. Tito, he. Uh, I don't know. I feel like Winterson could have just wiped that off. 
Every time Kenny just throws a jab Winters to keep him there. Winters nice saying just boom, boom, boom. Every time to keep him off of there. You know what I mean? Just so he's not obedient. Pause. He's not submissive. Pause. To um, Kenny. Just touching him right now. It's a touch spar. It's pretty yeah, on guy, he's just touching him. He's had hard sparring in the middle of this My fault. fault. I can't stress. Okay. Okay. See though. Hey. Pause. It's unbelievable Pause. the evolution we're seeing Kenny go through right in front of our eyes. Stepping into range, just playing with his feet. Okay. Food. I think this is where it was. Just whatever he wants, he's loose. No defense because he oh my god. It. He is styling on Winterson Nunez, cross guard, stomping in the range. Oh, okay, I think, I think this is where it was. Oh my god. I'm not even joking with you. Look at the head. Holy shit. Are you kidding me? Alright, this this does this, this, this is a clip. King, what am I seeing right now? Masterclass. Oh, you're watching the king. I'm, I'm truly watching a man that is wearing the crown. This is a performance for the ages in influencer boxing. This is a rare world. Nah, moment. he's him. No nope, meat ride. He's him. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like that is one of the best out of all the influencer boxing shit. I think that's up there as one of the best. I'm not gonna lie to you. I was not rating King Kenny this high in influencer boxing in the scene in total. Cause I, I'm not gonna lie. I thought he was gonna get dog walked by um Saw Poppy if they ever fought, and he lost to Ashley Raksu, which. It's not saying like anything like, oh, Ashley Rack's garbage or some shit like that, but um, it's just you didn't expect him to lose that fight. Um, I know they were supposed to do a loser's bracket, but nobody came back from the first one of the losers because Tom a loser, um, Austin a loser, um, my man Nate seemed kind of cool. I don't know why he didn't do it, and the other dude is also a loser. I don't even remember his name, but he had a bunch of like, Grubhub tattoos on the back of his back. Um, but yeah, I feel like there might not be that much crowd, like interaction. Uh, not an interaction because they weren't really. I get not actually. Yeah, I think it is interaction. I don't think there's gonna be much crowd interaction for the final unless they go back to the UK. The the final the the final. I, I'm gonna give my 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 thoughts on that. I'm not gonna lie to you. This whole thing I said. I'm pretty sure from when it started, I said Gibb was gonna take this in the bag. And then after the first round, I was like, it might not be as easy as I thought it was gonna be for Gibb. Cause they, they are some dogs in this fight. And now looking back at it, pause. Um, it's, I don't wanna say it's not looking good for Gibb, but it's not looking good for Gibb. And I feel like I always, not doubt Gib, but yeah, I don't know what to say. I, I, I always doubt Gib, but it's not even like a bad thing. I think it's better being the underdog because that way you get to prove people wrong. But um, like I was, I, I doubted Kenny too. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, Kenny, I thought, I thought he was not up there at all in the slightest bit. If I'm being honest with you, I didn't think he was top five. Now I'm pretty sure he is top five after because whoever wins this this um tournament is definitely top five, top three if you ask me because there's nobody else was, was fighting as consistent like and then putting everything out there if that makes sense. My prediction I think I don't know because Gib and his trainer they were saying Gib has power now. Gib has a lot of power. This that third but. Bro, he, he didn't knock down Jarvis at all, I'm pretty sure. And I just watched it. He didn't knock him down. He didn't knock Austin down. Austin got tired and fucking became a pussy and his ankle hurt or some shit. He knocked him down the first fight, which is true. I'll give him his props there. I just don't think he has that power, for real. Against Holder, too, he, he won the fight convincingly, but he didn't knock him out. He didn't knock him down, either. Kenny knocked down... Two other, now three of his opponents. Did he knock him out? He knocked one of them out, I'm pretty sure. But, um, I don't know. Gib, Gib has a lot more stamina. Kenny does have a longer reach, more height. So he could definitely just keep Gib on his on the back end, you know? 
I, I think I'm gonna have to give it to Kenny, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Am I gonna be, if I if I'm wrong, I'm wrong. I really is not that big of a deal for me because either way, either one of them wins. They're both people that I think deserve to win. You know, that's that's all, that's all I gotta say about this. I'm not gonna lie. I got King Kenny at the end just because he's a longer reach. Um, but if he doesn't win, I wouldn't be surprised if Gib does just or maybe Gib just throws a lot more punches than Kenny and he just gets more um he gets overwhelmed Kenny gets overwhelmed with the punches and Gib could just hit him with a good one but um that's how I see that going um I have I still have to react to the Spider-Man 2 gameplay or trailer because now he has drop they dropped two hold on now they dropped two trailers for um Spider-Man 2 the game and Blue Beetle they already dropped the second and last trailer for Blue Beetle. And I'm pretty sure the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, I also have to react to the second trailer. Cause the first one, I kind of, the, the video kind of bugged out. So you really couldn't see much of the trailer. Cause I, I didn't want to edit bullshit. But anyway, that's besides the point. I hope y'all enjoyed the video. The little breakdown, I guess, the little reaction. And whatnot more videos coming consistently y'all make sure to like to like subscribe and share also watch the the last video i posted watch the podcast the podcast i think the podcast was that actually the last video i posted i'm not gonna lie to you i'm gonna check real quick yeah the irregular show podcast episode seven y'all make sure to go watch that um they fought at the lake y'all go watch that that shit got crazy i'm not gonna lie y'all y'all like this video up and I'll and I'll, I'll I'll set up a, a boxing fight. And I'll get a bunch of people on that on a card. Do my own thing. Since since the misfits playing around, they don't want to add a young bull onto the bitch, you know. But um, yeah, go go look at the channel. I got some good videos, man. Y'all y'all really sleeping on me. I'm not gonna lie. If you see this on your recommended, like the video. It don't cost you much. And if you if you like the video, just go ahead and, and look at other videos. Look look look. I got a. <clears throat> Jarvis whooped Floyd Mayweather. I'm on the next F Misfits X Zone undercard. I lied, cause you know I'm a liar. Um, my New Year's video, a short video. These these are my favorite too. But um, I'm I'm chatting. I'm just rambling on. But yeah, y'all y'all go watch the videos, man. Y'all go show some love, and I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace.